the San Cisco A21 Mini Battle Drone. It has altitude hold, headless mode, one button takeoff and landing, three speeds, 3D flip, and a battle game. It comes in red and yellow. So let's check out what we get in the box. We get a user manual, a packet with a screwdriver, four spare props, a USB charger to charge your 3.7 volt, 180 milliamp hour LiPo batteries. Here's the controller that requires two AAA batteries. And here is the A21. So the A21 Mini Battle Drone is a drone where you can either just fly it by itself as a drone, because it does have a lot of different features on, you can also fly two or more of these around and battle it out. So that is the infrared beam that sends the signal out. And then here is a receiver module, which will tell you if you got hit with the infrared beam. So I know what you're thinking, how can I test it out if I only have one drone? San Cisco sent me two of them. So we're gonna go do a little battle, test out the battle mode, and then test out all the other features that come with the A21. It's time to fly the San Cisco A21. And right there is the battery hatch. Slip the battery in, and then it plugs inside the hatch there. It's a little tough to plug in. There we go. Close that and it does latch. We have the on and off switch right there. And there we have it. So blue is for the front and red is for the back. After you turn the controller on, it does auto bind. So to calibrate the gyro, you go down and out. And once they stop flashing, then it's calibrated. So there's two ways to take off. You can take off by either pressing this button here which arms it and then it takes off by itself. And then that's the same to land it, press the button and down it goes. Or you can do it this way. You go down and in, it arms the motors and then you hit up on the throttle and there you go. And then you can just land it just like that. And then that's the other way to land it. And there's one more feature. Let's take off here. One more feature is an emergency landing, is if you push the right and left stick in for one second and hold them in, it cuts the power for emergency landing. And then this is your left and right trim and your forward and backwards trim right here. Now let's talk about the speeds and the flips because this has three speeds and it does do the 360 flips so let's do the flips first. All you do is press the right stick. Now you hear the beeping. Pick which direction. There was a front flip. Let's do that again. Let's do a roll. So it isn't that strong on the, on the flips. It does lose altitude a little bit. Let's do a back flip. There, there I did all four directions. Now let's check out the speed. So the speed button's right here. Now we're in the second rate. You can definitely notice the yaw picked up a little bit. And let's go three rates. Oh, there we go. So we are in the third rate now. So the only other thing, there's the funnels. Testing out the funnels. Okay, so the only other thing that is left is headless mode, besides the battle mode, but headless mode, if you wanna fly this by itself. This is also the battle mode button, but you short press it when you're in battle mode if you wanna shoot at the other drone. You long press until you hear a beep. Yep, look, headless mode. Wow, headless mode is actually really good on this one. 
So let's get out of headless mode. We'll do a long press again and we are back in regular mode. Okay, now it's time to try out battle mode. So let's land this. Land it right there. Okay, now we're ready for battle mode. We're gonna take off. I'm gonna let the one just hover around and I'm gonna shoot at it with the infrared beam. Whichever drone gets hit with the infrared beam, it, it like shakes. You get hit four times and it automatically lands. So let's try it out. We're gonna take off in three, two, one. <laughs> okay, the head of the drone has to be facing the one you're firing at. Oh, I just hit it. Let's see if it, yep, there's twice now. Let's do it again. Oh, there, it got it. There's three times. This will be four. Let's see what happens on four. Oh, oh, <laughs> it just, it just drops. That's four hits and now he's done. So now we're gonna go into like real battle. Did I get him? Oh, I missed. Oh, I did get him. <laughs> oh, I got hit. Oh, I got hit again. I hit him. Oh. Oh, I got him again. Oh. <laughs> this is pretty fun. These drones, they should sell these in a two pack where you can get two of these because it, it's fun like flying around. Oh, I got him again. <laughs> oh, he's. <laughs> uh oh. What happened there? Can you take off? Oh, I got him. Oh, we hit each other. Oh, that was the fourth one on me. And I got the fourth one on him at the same time. So that's pretty fun. These are really cool drones. Now, when low voltage is detected, you will see that the LEDs are flashing. You won't be able to do any more flips or anything like that. But that is it for the San Cisco A21 battle drones. Such a fun little drone. It flies really good. And I definitely recommend getting the second one so you can have a little battle game. If you just want one drone, that's fine too, because this is a decent drone to fly around indoors. It does okay with the flips. It does lose a little bit of altitude with the flips. You do get about eight to 10 minutes of flight time, so that's not bad at all. The headless mode works flawlessly. You do get the three speeds. The third speed is pretty fast. Altitude holds, so it's very beginner friendly. So, and thanks for watching, but I can't wait to see who wins the next Ready to Run RC.